Hi everyone, welcome back to my backyard and the video today I just want to give you the update about how my service will be doing this season. Now, uh, I just have it, uh, I need a new big bowl of the berries already because the other day my friends came over and I was so excited to show her because in Vietnam we don't have this type of tree. So I was excited and of course she loves the berry as well and after we were in the middle have its own the berry and after that I feel suddenly a remember oh I should show you about my service berry so yeah so here is um uh the I I don't know maybe another portion of the food left because I have it quite a lot on that day already uh, and um, I just want to give you the updates and you might wondering how they are doing this season and consider we have it quite a lot and you can see still have lots of berry on and you can see this on the little purple one here like very deep purple here they are vibrant already and the taste delicious Mm. And the little one, oh, you can see the one that only still have a bright red like this. They're not ready yet. We just have it the one that deep purple like this. They're very sweet and juicy. They're so, so nice. So this is the second year seeing it uh, bear the fruits because I planted uh, this tree one year ago and after that I got the berry straight away and here is uh, the second year and I'm so pleased with that the fruit I think doubles the amount of the fruit the berries the last year uh, and underneath here I got uh, oh, I got several like little shoots underneath of the tree as well let me show you uh, I thought that maybe I'm going to keep some of the trunk stem here and to keep them like for the tree to produce like more multiple trunk other than one main trunk here because if something happened in the future if the one of main trunk die so that means we have no other trunk left and so maybe that not good oh i just like to have some options you know because i love the tree so much the other day i went to uh, the nursery i asked two nursery in our area they don't have this tree in stock so now i really want another tree as well because i love the berry and look at this are they looking delicious so i have to net the trees how uh, because of birds they love the berry one more thing though these trees they do have uh, affected by the cherry snack so you can see here i think the little uh, cherry snack is dried out already but i do have some leaf got affected by it uh not too bad um you can see all most of the leaves they are very clean but i just want to show you this one they, they do have a uh, like cherry snack attack them all right let me just go ahead and to have its own this delicious berry Right guys, I'm not sure if I could capture about the part that I just said Oh, I will have everything or picking the berry or not But anyway, uh, maybe I forgot to turn the camera on And so here is the result And I picked, uh, look at that Full bowl of the berry, a lot more than last year And the other day, I already picked this amount as well So this is really good and look at that Look so yummy and when I were picking and I were eating some as well I still have some left over down here let me show you because I want to save some for my parents-in-law when they come down here to try because last year they uh, did not have a chance to try it because last year we got them um, I mean less amount of the berry but also they came down a little bit later as well so yeah I just want to save them I put the netting back though and then they can have a chance to try the berries so yeah, very previous that. 
Hi, Nick, we're coming so it's very really, and uh, loving this. I am um, gonna, gonna go inside and to watch the, this, just wait some more a little bit, and then we're gonna enjoy all of them. So, that is for the video today. I hope you enjoy seeing my beautiful Sophie Berry, so productive, and the berry looks so yummy. And see you next video. Bye bye.